Good morning, I'm Brooke Hafes with NBC26 and this is your morning news update. The man accused of kidnapping Jamie Kloss and killing her parents is heading back to court. 21-year-old Jake Patterson will go before a judge today for a preliminary hearing. Patterson has been charged with kidnapping and homicide. Patterson made his first court appearance less than a month ago when bail was set at $5 million. Today he will be back in court at 11 a.m. If convicted, he faces life in prison. A vaping epidemic, that's what the U.S. Surgeon General calls the use of electronic cigarettes among teens. Now some city leaders in Green Bay are trying to change the trend. Currently under Wisconsin law, it's illegal for stores to sell e-cigarettes with nicotine to minors. But the law says nothing about those without nicotine. One alderman says he'd like to see an ordinance drafted as soon as possible so that the city could vote on it in early March. I'm meteorologist Michael Fish with NBC 26 and today kind of a little bit of a lull in the action, but it's going to be late tonight and especially tomorrow. That's where things go downhill and the farther you live to the north, the snowier the system will be. But Green Bay and to the Fox Cities, you're going to have some snow, some sleet, some freezing rain and the farther you live to the south and east, the more this will be maybe some ice or some freezing rain. There's some rain even possible in there too. So lesser totals of snow to the south. There's Green Bay Fox cities one to three inches. All it takes is a system to change just a couple degrees in temperature for this to move around. But the farther you live to the north, the more snow you're going to see for your Thursday. Now as far as ice, that's like possibly Manitowoc, Sheboygan, Fond du Lac with some ice accumulation for you. It might stick on some of the trees or power lines, but because of this mess on the way for mainly Thursday, winter storm watch for most of the area, our southern counties, winter weather advisory starts tonight because it could get a little bit icier there, less snowy. 30 today though, freezing drizzle early, otherwise most of the day kind of that low. The evening, all right, maybe a wintry mix to the south early, but otherwise late, we're going to see that become more widespread. And tomorrow, things going downhill, some of you with snow, some sleet, some rain and freezing rain, just kind of a mess. A little bit snowier the farther north and west you live. Now, this moves on out as we head through Thursday night and Friday. Blustery and colder with a high of 8. Saturday looking cold. Sunday, just a chance of a little bit of light snow. Now, stay connected all day, every day at NBC26.com, or you can download the NBC26 app. It's free on the App Store.